a citywide car-sharing system with a fleet that is 100% electric. When Autolib was created in 2011, it was the pride of city officials. French industrialist Vincent Bolloré teamed up with the city of Paris to launch the ambitious project. But since then, Autolib hasn't managed to break a profit. The service racked up 210 million euros of losses by the end of 2017, according to its operator. A poor record due to competition from car hailing apps and a deteriorating service. Everything is dirty. Often. Not just this, but bits of paper, cigarette butts. Despite the number of users going down, there are still over 100,000 people who are subscribed to the service. People who live in and around Paris who will have to find new ways of transportation. I don't know what I'm going to do. It's a pity. Maybe something else should replace it. I don't know. The Bolloré Group could be replaced by another operator. Car companies such as Peugeot, Citroën and BMW have all expressed their interest in taking up the project. Meanwhile, it won't be a quick divorce for the group and the city of Paris. Terminating their contract five years early means both sides will have to agree on a payout and on the fate of 250 Autolib employees.